Hey guys, Traveling Taylor back at you. I come every week with new videos, new tips and experiences for the digital nomad life. So if you are interested in hearing more, be sure to subscribe so that you don't miss a new video again every Tuesday. So I want to do something a little different this week, which was actually review a new purchase that I just made. So I've been traveling for 16 months and I am now on my third suitcase. My very first suitcase lasted about a year, which to be fair is pretty good when you're using something every single day. It broke finally when I was in Thailand. I had a total movie moment where I got off the bus and it starts pouring down rain as soon as I step off and I'm rolling down the street at my phone for the directions in my hand. I'm soaking wet and the wheel pops off as I'm walking down the street and it just continued to pour and rain and then I got a cold that week while I was in Thailand, which was not fun. But then last week I was in New York City going to my Airbnb accommodation and again, my wheel popped off. <laughs> so not, I do not have a lot of luck with suitcase wheels. Um, I did decide early on in the process, I did wanna go with a suitcase and not a backpack so that it is an, another option that you could do. So you don't have to deal with wheels and um, cobblestone streets, which I've had a lot of, and stairs and things like that. You'll just throw it on your back. But for me, I decided that I would prefer the suitcase because I do travel a little bit slower. It's not so bad most of the time. Except now, here I am 16 months in and I've had to buy another suitcase. So um, the suitcase that I decided to go with is actually an away suitcase. So here it is, away. I will go into a little more detail and show you all the features of it of why I love it. But first I just wanna talk a little bit about the company. So I've actually been following this company on Instagram for probably the last year. And I've known of their suitcase and their luggage. I actually think I was introduced to them through a podcast. It was one of their ads that people have so you can get a discount. And I was like, oh, interesting. And I looked it up and it always looked like great luggage and a really cool company. Their brand, their messaging is just so consistent and on point and I love them from the very beginning. Unfortunately, my finances were not in like a great spot before I left, so I ended up getting a cheaper suitcase than the one that I actually wanted from away, and that is the one that broke. And then I got one very similar to it when I was in Thailand, and that one also broke. So that is what finally pushed me to just go for it and get an away suitcase. Another big reason is that they have a lifetime warranty. Let me say that again. Their luggage, not all their bags, I think like their backpack only has a one year warranty, but all of their luggage has a lifetime warranty, which makes getting this and my travel life so worth it. So the next time a wheel pops off, which hopefully it won't anytime soon, but the next time it does, I could just contact support and they will actually help me get a new suitcase. The other reason I decided to go with it at this moment in time is I was in New York, they have their flagship um, brick and mortar store. So a lot of their sales are online, but they have their actual headquarters and then their main store is in New York. And so I was able to touch and see it and feel it. And I went in knowing I was gonna buy it and I left being really happy. But I also have a hundred days to change my mind. And I will talk about that a little bit later as to the one that I think I might actually switch to and why that is. That's what we're doing today, reviewing my Away suitcase. So let's go ahead and let's do it. This is my Away suitcase and this is the medium size bag. So they have a carry-on, a bigger carry-on, a medium and a large, I believe, are the four sizes. And I went with a, a medium because it was most similar to my current suitcase or my previous suitcase although a little bit bigger. And I really want to switch to the bigger carry-on. So that's the one I think I'm gonna trade this in for, for a couple of reasons. Um, one, this is just a little too big. So I wasn't quite ready when I was in New York to downsize my suitcase, but I am gonna be going home pretty soon to Texas and I'll have the opportunity to kind of get rid of a few things that I was holding on to and really think about how to pack and downsize a little bit more. So I actually don't wanna go bigger, which this is a little bit bigger. I actually have some extra space and room in here. 
do you want to go a little bit smaller? The second reason I'm going to go with the bigger carry-on is because it has a built-in charger into the suitcase. So both the carry-on and bigger carry-on have the um, lithium battery so you can charge your phone while you're at the airport or you know while you're traveling around. So there have been a handful of times that I've been at the airport and cannot find a plug. So I think I'm going to on my layover, charge my computer or my phone or whatever it is. And they're just, you know, some of these airports are a little bit older and they weren't built with that in mind. And so it would be really nice to just have that in my suitcase while I'm traveling. So that's why I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna switch to the bigger carry-on, but I'll go ahead and show you the features of the away suitcase because other than the battery, they are the same. You do also here at the top have a lock um, that is TSA approved, security approved. Um, so if you are someone who likes to lock your suitcase while you're in the airport, so nothing happens to your items, um, you do have that option and you set your own code for it. Okay, so let's dive in. So Away is, brands themselves as travelers who make luggage for travelers. So you're gonna see as we walk through the different features, I'm not gonna be on screen, as we walk through different features and I will show you just the different ways that they've actually thought about the traveler's life and what is convenient for each type of person. So, the zippers are very nice, as are the wheels. It moves so well. I can't even tell you how smooth it is when I'm rolling it. Okay, and I prefer suitcases that do open, like have two sides like this. And that is what I have. So we'll go through both sides separately. So this first side is the side where you keep your toiletries, your shoes, anything that is not your clothes, really. So you can see here, I have all of my little pouches. I have my packing cubes. This is my rain jacket. Um, I'm a huge fan of packing cubes. If you haven't seen my Marie Kondo video, I will link it down below so you can go watch and see how I actually pack my suitcase. But yes, so for this side is mainly just, um, I mean, you can see extra shoes are here and all my, <laughs> really, all my cubes. If you don't use packing cubes or pouches or things like this, I highly, highly recommend it because you can see how neat and organized my suitcases and I know exactly where everything in my bag is. So that is side A. Let's hop over to side B. Side B. So this is the side where you're going to want to put your clothes because you're actually able to compress it with the belt system. Um, and this part right here, you can flip over like this if you need to get into it, or it actually releases all together, which is actually pretty nice, especially if you're in a hotel or somewhere where you're staying for a, a little bit longer and you don't really need this piece. You can kind of just take it out and set it over here and be able to access your items quickly. Or if you don't want the compression piece at all, you could just take it out and you don't even have to travel with it. So again, packing cubes are my best friend. These are my pants. These are all my tops and dresses. That's how I have them split up. And you can see here, I mean, I do have like a good amount of extra space in here. And even with my tops, there's a little, like there's room. So there's a lot of wiggle room. So this bag is a little, the medium size is a little too large for what I actually need, but it is a really good, it is a really good size. You can also see that I pack my purse, my extra purse under here. It's a little bit nicer than what I, my daily one. And my workout bands <laughs> that is in my top 10 travel essentials, they also go pack nicely under my pants. So the other really cool feature that I love about the suitcase is you have this hidden away laundry bag. So it pops out just like this. You fold it up and it goes in and you have this bag. It has a zipper here on the end, so you can zip your clothes in and out. And then also, and I've already used this feature, it actually pops out as well. And so you have an actual laundry bag. So not just a dirty clothes bag, but a laundry bag that you can put your clothes in and take with you and go to the laundromat or 
I do a lot of house sitting. So this is actually perfect because a lot of times right now I just use my reusable grocery bags as sort of like one of my laundry bags. So now I can actually switch to this type of bag. And you can see it's really easy just to put back in, just fold it. It's actually a little bit of like Marie Kondo folding here. Do, 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 do. And it just fits right back into its little pocket and you don't even really know that it's there. It doesn't take up like any space when it's there. You can clip these back, pull them tighter. And everything is good to go and it's not gonna move. There you have it. There is my review on the Away suitcase. I absolutely love it. I love this color. They have, I think like six or seven different colors. They're all a little muted. They also have an aluminum style right now. You can get your, you can get it personalized. You can get your initials or name engraved on it if you want. And they do come out with special and fun colors every once in a while. Right now I think they have like bright colors that they have on that they have for sale. I stick with just more of a classic color that kind of fit my personality a little bit better. But yeah, that is the way suitcase. I've had it again for about a week. It works wonderfully. It rolls so well. I absolutely love it and I am really happy with my choice of brand. But like I said, I probably will downsize to the bigger carry on for because it's a little too big and I really want that charging capability. So if you've used Away or you have a favorite luggage brand, let me know. Um, I'd be happy to check it out. So thanks so much for watching you guys. Be sure to just subscribe. I'm here every Tuesday and giving you digital nomad tips. So see you next week.